everybody, it is Charlotte with Charlotte Plans, and I am here to bring you my plan with me for the week of February 5th through the 11th, and this week I am using the, I'm moving my phone off of my kit real quick, this week I am using this kit from Paper and Gumption, it is called Tea and Macaroons, quickly go through. And I already know that some of the cutting is off on this over here like it normally is. And I finally figured out what that why I'm having that issue with my silhouette. It's because the registration marks, I need to make these lines thinner and longer in order for it to cut the right way. So since I already had these pre-printed and everything, I wasn't about to waste the ink and the paper and all of that type of stuff. So I'm just going to make do with all the kits that I have already with these registration marks. I'm going to print them out and cut, or they're already printed, but I'm going to cut them out and continue to use them because I'm on a budget and everything. So I need to make sure that I'm making it, my, that I'm not wasting money. And to me, that's kind of wasting money. So I am going to go ahead and show you last week, which I'm still currently in. It is Saturday and I'm filming all of my videos over here. And this is everything so far that has happened and how it's looking out, looking so far. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and move my sticky note, which is the link where I purchased this from is always left down below in the description box. So, we are gonna go ahead and get started with the bottom washi on this kit. And Since we're in February, I didn't want to go all out and get all Valentine's type of kits, but I wanted to get kind of stuff that had pink and reds and everything like that in there. And in here, there are hearts in the kit and everything, and with the pink and the gold and all of that type of stuff, I really liked this kit. And I am looking through to see what I want to do, which I think is always, and I think I'm going to go ahead and keep the flags as they are because the pink does go with the pink in here, and I would just be replacing them with these pink ones and yeah, I really don't want to do that because then I would cut off the gold and everything and so yeah, we're just going to keep them as they are and I'm going to go ahead and lay the full boxes down and I'm going to go ahead and put the dream, dream it, do it quote over here in the sidebar. Okay, and then That's how I want to do it. Too much concentration for me to figure out what I want to do. How has everybody's week been? I'm a little disappointed that Punxsutawney Phil saw his shadow because I would rather winter be over with. Although we didn't, in Houston we don't get much of a winter. Usually the temperature is fall temperatures for the mo most of the world. But this year we did have two days of snow. Well. I, would, I should say this winter we had two days of snow because one snow day was in December and we've had one snow day and then one and a half ice days after the snow day and 
we are just not prepared for ice and snow and all of that type of stuff down here. So when it comes in, we, the whole city pretty much shuts down and the people that are out and about are usually the people that are from up north that are used to driving around and this stuff. The problem is, is that we don't have salt or any of that type of stuff. We don't have snow plows. We don't have any of that. And they just spray this, what is it? Sodium, magnesium, something, some type of chemical on the bridges and overpasses and then sprinkle aggregate out there to kind of um, allow for traction and everything but it doesn't do much because there were still lots of very thick patches of ice the second day there was a snow day the ice day and then the sec the second ice day on the second day I had drove into work and there were still lots of ice on the bridges and usually and it was right in between the lanes so if you tried to cross over you could hit a patch of ice and yeah. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and get the sidebar down and go from there. So I am laying the pink one down first. And then the blue one. Okay. And after that, I am going to make one, I forgot how I had, okay, one is a no spend, one is for exercise, and how did I do? I think I'm going to keep track of dinners for one of them, and that will be a weekly one, but then I need a to-do, so we'll do this one, and we'll take crooked. Or at least it appears to be crooked in my head. Okay, and then I'm going to separate this since it's two of the same color with some glitter washi and we're going to go for green. On the bottom of this check, or not check, but list box, there's a little strip of white because, you know, the cutting just didn't quite cut the right way. And I'm going to take a weekly box and make sure that I, have, yep, I should have enough room. And yet again, it looks crooked in my head. Perfect. Okay, and I'm tracking dinners this time because of being on a no spin, so that way I can list down my meal plan, and I kind of have something written down already, so that way I can go grocery shopping tomorrow. But that is where we are at right now. So now I'm going to go ahead and go through my week, and on Monday, the only thing that I have currently going on is work. And I am looking to see, okay, yes, I have enough. I'm going to use these stitched boxes right here. And use pink one from over here. And while I'm at it, I'm going to pull out my stickers. And this is a photo album that I had sitting around. Once I started printing out all these stickers, I realized I needed a way to keep 
track of them. And I think today we have on one of these kits two little desks right here. I am going to use some of these and these are kind of too bright. They are also from Paper and Gumption and I got them on a $2 Tuesday. They are printables. So we are going to start with pink and I'm not going to put a glitter header down like I normally do. I'm just going to go ahead and put them up here across the top and I don't care if this one covers part of that box. I kind of want to have all my work labels up across the top because that's usually the first thing that I do in the morning. I get up and go to work. Okay, and take off these two. This one, we need a green one. We'll use the green one over here. And there we go. And that's just to denote when I have work. And I just realized I did not need to use one of these at all. And that is my bad. So, because if I had looked over at my sticky note, I would have seen that I have a vacation day on the 6th. So, I don't really want the two pinks together, so that's why I'm moving them around. Okay, there we go. So I have a day off on Tuesday because of vacation. So back in my thing, I think I have one that says day off. There's my day off. I knew I had one that said day off. Okay. It's a little banner. And let's see. We will use the pinky one. There we go. Day off. I had an extra vacation day that I needed to take because my time starts over some on one of these days. I forgot when I what day I was actually hired on. So, but I do have a dentist appointment. Trying to find the dentist appointments again. I saw them somewhere. There they are. I have a dentist appointment at 7 a.m. So I can't really sleep in that day. So I'm going to put a flag. Should I put a green one? I think I should put a green one. And I'm changing my mind yet again. Okay, and I'm going to use the little one over here, and I will put the time. Okay. 
Okay, and then right after that, well, not right after, but I do have some time after that. I'm going to switch it over here. And I really need to find some chiropractor stickers because it's not really a doctor appointment. But I'm going to go ahead and put that as what it is. Because I have TMJ and everything, after I go to the dentist, I usually have to go to the chiropractor and have her pop my jaw back in place, even though the dentist tries to put it back in place and everything. It doesn't quite work out the right way. So, other than that, that is everything that is going on on Tuesday. Monday, all I had was work. Wednesday, I have work, and then I have a meeting. And I'm going to use a... use this half box down here. Okay, and that's good. I'm looking to see if any of these icons would fit in with that. But I'm not seeing one, so I am running back here to get my meeting stickers. Okay, and there's an alarm clock. So I'm going to add the alarm clock. And That is everything that is going on on Wednesday. On Thursday, it is payday. Very, very important. And very thankful that it is payday because, boy howdy, I'm getting low on cash. And that is partly why I am doing a no spend. February. Sorry, got slightly distracted there. And finding my payday stickers. Okay. Let's just go ahead and stick with the paper in gumption. And where's the green? Payday. Okay, there we go. And I know that's crooked. I can see it from here. And I have no nails on my hand. I don't know why I am biting them and messing with them. Well, I do. The weather is not helping out with them. Okay, Friday I only have work. And then we have on Saturday I'm actually going to put this because it's kind of later in the day. But it is Mardi Gras. Or it's a Mardi Gras festival. So I'm looking to see if there's anything that's like party. Party, party, party. And I don't see anything that stands out. And I don't remember if there was anything that stood out over here either. Okay, so I am just gonna use one of these balloons because I don't have any other better option currently so yeah
Okay. And then that is everything that is going on on Tuesday. And then on Sunday, I have a bill due. And I'm just going to go with the blue. And it is my internet bill. Okay. I am debating. Should I put in the date covers? No. No, I won't do that. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and fill this in. So I, oh, there were some stickers that I wanted to use over here. Okay, because I saw them as I was flipping through multiple times. Okay. We have Belle. with no spend and then one for exercise somewhere and of course the one I want is buried way inside of the book and I could use the kettlebell that came with the kit but I'm actually trying to do a little bit more yoga, although that's kind of big. Okay, we will go with the kettlebell. And for me right now, exercise is not an actual exercise regimen or plan or anything like that. It is just right now, currently, taking a flight of stairs that I don't normally take. It's, it's, I'm slowly trying to get back into better shape and everything, and just by doing that little thing five days a week or four days a week or however many, it's one step closer to getting better, getting more in shape. So that's what I'm trying to do is, with the meal planning, trying to get to where I'm eating healthier for 28 days and not eating out, and then slowly adding in a little bit more exercise. So. I am currently right now adding a flight of stairs at work because normally I take an escalator to get up to the main floor that has the elevators, but instead I'm taking the, I've taken the stairs for the past week except for one day because my toe that I think I broke was really starting to hurt me, so it feels a lot better today, but it definitely was hurting and I didn't want to go up the stairs when it's hurting because it could just cause it to get worse. So that is everything for this week. I have no plans to add any extra things. Through. Well, you know, except for going through the week and putting down the things that I do. I am one of those people that watch way too much TV. I need three more. Okay. Pink again. Red again. And the green again. Okay. So we have two of the dark reds. And I always throw these down at the end of the day. Two greens. And two pinks. One blue, one pink, okay. I like to keep track of what shows I'm watching as well because I tend to forget when you're going through Netflix, a lot of things that the when you get to the end of a show it says, you may like, and since I've been watching a lot of Asian dramas, I like to keep track of what I have watched, so it's, I'm 
adding them in here throughout the year and I've done that through last year and everything so it allows me to know which ones I have watched and when they pop up again it's like oh you can't you don't need to watch that again it was good the first time but it doesn't need to you don't need to waste time and watch it again okay so that one says no spin dinners and I have yet to decide how I'm, what I'm gonna cook okay we have 7 a.m. 9 10 a.m. Payday, those are self explanatory. Uh, this is 12 p.m. to 6 p.m. Okay, and then bill due is internet, and it is 117, and it is an automatic. Okay, that is how the week is shaping out so far. I will of course come back next week and show you a look at how it's going so far and just like I did earlier where I showed you what is what we the week I'm currently in and I need to put over here that I didn't spend anything or and that I did some exercise and I have yet to do any exercise or anything like that and that is everything that is going on. Notice my mom cut my hair and it's the shortest it's been in decades. I'm trying to recall when I've had it this short and it is so hard trying to straighten it because I can't even like separate my, my hair is very thick. So I'm one of those that has to put sections of her hair up to do her hair, to do my hair. And it, it's very difficult when it's short and you can't put it up. And then when you, take the sections down and you can't put those sections up and it, it's been very difficult so I'm it's only been a couple days I I mean it's Saturday so I just got my hair cut and it's taking a while to figure out how to do my hair since this was really only the second day that I've done my hair because I did it this day before going to work and then I didn't need to wash my hair these two days I washed it this morning was it? no it was last night so I washed my hair last night. Anyways, here is a look at next week, and I will be back with you guys next week. If you are interested in anything that is an Erin Condren, please see the link down below because, or the links down below because I have left links to where you can purchase this book. And if you are interested in any of these stickers, I will leave the links down below to the shop. Most of them are from Paper and Gumption. I'm trying to look to see if there's anything that is not paper and gumption. No, they are all paper and gumption. So I will leave a link down to the shop below. She is on Etsy and a lot of the stickers that I have I purchased on a $2 Tuesday and I they are all printables. I was able to buy them all, print them out, and cut them all out. And that took a better part of two weekends because the stack of stickers when I printed out one sheet each was about this thick. Yes, that thick. And so it took one weekend to print and then another weekend to cut. <laughs> so I was going a little crazy the past two weekends, but I'm glad that it's done now and I have, and then once I cut them all, I went through in this and started grouping all of them together. And so there are some in here that are not paper and gumption and any, or anything like that but I do like the paper and gumption ones because they are very 
they're the right size and everything to fit in here and not fall out like some of these are falling out when I flip the pages but that is okay I will make do with what my my current sticker storage because I'm not about to go out and buy more money or spend more money to get to purchase stuff that is not that I don't need when I had that empty photo album sitting around the house because I no longer print my pictures and which is unless I want one specific one so I keep them all digital and I'm putting my bookmark back in here on the day on the week that I am currently in so that way I can flip to it and actually do some stuff and I've actually done two things here oh I haven't done the budget with me I've done the plan with me now but my next thing is the budget with me So I hope everybody enjoyed this, and like I said, all the links will be down in the description box below, and I will see you guys next week. Bye, everybody!